they'll eat it anyway. In the bush, food is food, and this could be an appetizer. Or they may have already eaten, and this is dessert. Whatever the case may be, the rabbit is cooked, fried, and roasted. Rabbits aren't the best prey for wild dogs because they're so small, and feeding a pack of wild dogs takes a lot more than a small rabbit. However, for the time being, the dogs will take what they can get. These greyhounds are chasing a rabbit through the open field, and he's not easy to catch. These are not wild dogs by any means, but we thought we'd include them in the countdown because of the spectacular chase. The rabbit is simply too much for the dogs, and they must expend all their energy in order to have a chance of catching this fluffy ball of fur. The rabbit appears to have left some fur behind, but he may have escaped. Number 7. Wild Dogs Attack Antelope These wild dogs try to bring down this antelope, and they're all pulling viciously on the antelope's backside, trying to open it up. It's just a matter of time before they do, and when that happens, it's goodbye antelope. Number 6. Wild Dogs Attack Buffalo a larger buffalo is having trouble with a pack of wild dogs. The dogs are both biting the buffalo's backside, while the others gather around to help. When the rest of the pack, which is massive, arrives, the buffalo is quickly consumed. Buffalo are powerful animals that have been known to clash with lions. They're massive, and a good stab with one of their horns could be fatal. Unless they are after a younger calf, wild dogs have little chance of bringing down a full-grown buffalo. That is exactly what they do in this video. They've encircled the calf and are slaughtering it right in front of its mother. The mother appears to have given up defending her offspring because they are simply too many dogs. The mother is finally chased away from the area after one final attempt, and the dogs can eat in peace. If the mother knows what's best for her at this point, she should flee, because the calf cannot be saved. Number 5. Wild Dogs Attack Wildebeest these wildebeest are large and powerful, and their hooves and horns can cause significant damage, but the dogs don't seem to mind. The dogs are looking for calves, but the adult wildebeest form a ring around them, making it difficult for the dogs to approach them. When the wildebeest come face to face with the dogs, they have the upper hand. When they start running, they give the dogs the advantage, but this is inevitable because wildebeest don't like dealing with predators head on. As a result, when the herd runs, the calf can't keep up, and it's to the dog's benefit. It's not the largest wildebeest, but it'll suffice for now. A dramatic hunt ensues when a pack of wild dogs separates a young wildebeest from its mother. The predators encircle the terrified animal, trapping it in a water hole. Can the tenacity of a hungry pack of wild dogs triumph over the wildebeest's desperate survival attempts? These dogs are attempting to approach a younger wildebeest, but its mother is on guard, and nothing will happen unless they distract her. They won't be able to grab the calf if they just keep yakking at the mom and she doesn't move out of there, unless one of the dogs is attacked by the mom. The following clips demonstrate how lethal dogs can be when they tear different wildebeests to pieces during various attacks. Wildebeests are no pushovers, but when the dogs work together, they are difficult to beat. These wild dogs are attacking a wildebeest in a marsh like possessed demons. The wildebeest is attacked from all sides but manages to land a few blows and injures one of the dogs. On the sidelines, the vultures scout for opportunities. Number 4. Wild Dogs Attack Kudu The kudu is a massive antelope that looks like a reindeer, and wild dogs love it. Although the kudu is quite large and tries to kick out with its legs, the dogs are tenacious and manage to take it down and begin disemboweling it alive. The dogs viciously bite through the kudu and there's nothing the kudu can do. This kudu has been essentially killed by these wild dogs. The kudu is still alive and well, but it lacks the strength to stand up, let alone fight back. The wild dogs keep disemboweling the poor victim. With many onlookers watching, this kudu is destroyed on the side of a road. People are standing and enjoying themselves. They are reminiscent of Roman spectators watching gladiators fight tigers and lions at the Colosseum. But this gives the wild dogs plenty of time to bite into their prey and injure it before tearing it and devouring it. A pack of wild dogs is dragging a kudu out of the water. They drag the kudu to the ground and begin devouring it alive. Their tenacity is incredible. Nothing, not even a massive hippo, would be able to change their minds once they've decided to launch an attack. Number 3. Wild Dogs Attack Sasebe The Sasebe, also known as the common Sasebe, is a Bonte Bach relative. It has a comical appearance with high sloped shoulders that drop to a small, not particularly robust rump. And guess what? 
The common Tsebe is a favorite of wild dogs who enjoy a good stand-up routine now and then, especially when they get the last laugh, as they do in this video when they devour one. The show didn't last long in this video as the dogs tugged in different directions, gulping down every piece of meat they could get their hands on. The pain must be unbearable for the animal, but I'm guessing the dogs don't seem to mind, as long as they're eating. Another Tsebe is apprehended right away and learns about wild dogs. It couldn't do anything, no matter how hard it tried. Imagine being born in a world where you are drop-shipped in the middle of nowhere, and almost everyone sees you as food or competition. Number 2. Wild Dogs Attack Puku These wild dogs attack a puku in the shallow Kapamba River. Whether it's on land or water, nothing stops wild dogs from getting their meal. Thankfully, these dogs don't have wings. Another traveler on the lonely road of life is tracked down by a pack of wild dogs, and his journey comes to an end. Number 1. Doles Attack Sambar Deer This lone dole attacks a sambar deer in the water, while a few of his friends watch from the riverbank. But the sambar deer can drag the dole with him in deeper water, so the doles are not safe. The deer is much larger than the dole, so I doubt this single dole will be able to bring this deer back to shore without the assistance of his friends. A sambar deer visiting a watering hole is surrounded by a pack of doles. The sambar deer immediately screams for help. It occasionally makes a loud call because it realizes it is in serious trouble. It's a crazy world out there and things happen all the time. After more than an hour of struggle, the drama begins when the doles take turns attacking the deer until it tires out and is unable to fight back. The doles planned everything like the seasoned hunters they are. They had the entire area covered, with four of them stationed at each corner to keep the deer at bay. Finally, the sambar deer yielded and they cruelly ate it alive. These dolls are attempting to steal a baby sambar, but Mama is defending herself. The dolls persist and it becomes a battle of endurance and tenacity. The dolls get a bite here and there and the mother almost charges into them every one now and then. The dolls can even drag the baby at times, but when Mama turns around, the dolls let go. It doesn't look good for the calf, and I doubt the doles will give up until they kidnap the youngster. The mother is doing a good job, but the calf appears exhausted and ready to give up, and the mother is most likely heading in the same direction. I don't like seeing animals being torn to shreds like the ones we have just seen, but I must admit the way wild dogs work together is quite impressive. I don't have a favorite for this countdown. I'm just amazed at how these animals plan and execute a hunt. Which one was your favorite? Why don't you let us know in the comments below? Well, that's it for our countdown of 15 attacks by impatient and merciless wild dogs. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a like and let us know in the comments what you think. Check out our other videos and subscribe to be part of the